there's that Tom DeLonge book, Secret Machines, that suggests that that's where all the money in the world is disappearing to. It's like secret UFO black projects. <laughs> Which, to be honest, if that turned out to be true, I'd kind of be all right with it. You know, if, if suddenly we had like incredible spacefaring activities. But I don't know. Because he said it was like, I think kind of fiction. <laughs> a lot of that comes from Ian McKinnon in the late 90s, early noughties. Uh, he hacked into NASA. Uh, I, don't, I don't know, are you aware of the story of Ian McKinnon? No, please, enlighten me. <laughs> he hacked into NASA, and as, as far as I'm aware, or, or at least the stories I've heard, um, he, he went as far as to when uh, somebody was using a terminal at NASA, he said, yeah, I'm just the IT department, just leave this on. And he was typing that on the terminal from uh, Scotland. And he claimed to have um, found NASA documents claiming that there was a uh, huge human fleet on orbit of uh, these dark projects that, that, you know, I mean, dark projects exist. And I know a lot of people uh, say UFOs, like UFO is unidentified flying objects. You know, if if you saw um, a, a new uh, military plane fly over and couldn't identify it, even though you'd know it's a plane, it's still an un, unidentified flying object. Mm. Um, you know, there's, there's things like the Galactic Federation. Did you hear the stories of the Galactic Federation last year? Oh, man, yeah. No, I love these stories. <laughs> Which... L less believable than than sort of some of it that you know there's aliens living under the surface of mars with u.s officials and and this kind of thing but yeah I, c I can believe that black budget um has seen things like the um x-37 space plane uh that was uh initially a black budget project it wasn't spoken about until it returned to earth uh, that's for anybody watching. That's a uh, miniaturized uh, robotic version of the space shuttle. Thanks for making it all the way to the end of the podcast. Don't forget our sponsor, ExpressVPN, and my book, Brexit, The Establishment Civil War, can both be found in the links in the description below. And also, please like, share, and subscribe to this podcast. It's the best way to help us grow. Until next time, thanks for listening.